Hey, good morning. This is Joey from the Gym Junkies. Uh, it's one of those early mornings again. Uh, so yesterday I was able to get in the gym and I uh, was able to get some good chest workout in. Like I said, my, my week is all screwed up, so it's probably not the best week to follow my workout. <laughs> But I really got a good chest, shoulder, a little bit of tricep. So I figured, you know what, I have not done yet and I've been really excited to try it. I'm feeling pretty good today, this morning to go ahead and do, is uh, do an arm workout, solely arm workout. So I already hit my shoulder yesterday. So what we're gonna do is gonna play with uh, hitting my rear delts because I didn't really get to hit those as hard as I wanted to yesterday. So I'm going to start with my rear delts. I'm going to really build up a really good pump to him. And then I'm going to transition over to doing uh, biceps. Let's do an assortment of different biceps routines. And then we're going to just finish off and um, kill whatever triceps I have. So since this month is starting a new one, and I finished doing the shock therapy for the biceps last month, we're going to start the, the shock therapy for the triceps. So this will be the third day of doing the tricep shock of this month. So that's pretty cool. Uh, hopefully the same kind of results that I had for stimulating my biceps every workout for one month will have the same effect on my triceps. And that way I can keep my arms balanced because uh, I, I've definitely felt like my biceps got a little bigger, definitely got a lot stronger, but I'm just trying to give them, this is gonna be four days of rest, so uh, but this is going to be my one time of the week where I'm really going to annihilate them. So I'm not going to work it out four or five times a week like I did last month. So aside from that, I'm at the gym. Pre-workout starting to kick in. Uh, let's go ahead and get going with everything and see how all the footage turns out. All right. Hey guys, this is Joey from the Gym Junkies. We just finished up the workout. Uh, this was really cool today. I'm, I'm actually probably gonna keep this uh, this little routine day. I started with doing uh, rear, rear delts to hit like the top of my arms. And then I worked my way into doing biceps. I did uh, start with hammer curls. From hammer curls, I went to uh, single dumbbell curls. And from dumbbell curls, I went to barbell curls. From barbell curls, I went back to uh, I went to preacher curls, from preacher curls I went to cable curls, and then from cable curls I went to concentration curls. So it was a lot of biceps. Then I flipped it around and just massacred whatever was left of my triceps from yesterday. Um, I don't know if I got the sets in there where I started with, I went from 20 to 40 to 60 to 80 to 90, and then I went 80, 70, 60, 50, 40, 30 down to I can do 10 with 20 pounds. So uh, I did that and then I did uh, cable push downs and then reverse grip uh, tricep push down. So 
felt good. It felt really good to uh, beat the heck out of my biceps and my triceps and the top of my rear delts. Uh, I think I'm definitely going to make that a day and take it an hour and a half. So that's a great thing. I know we haven't had a lot of like bro science or conversations about supplements. So I thought it would be a good idea today because I did get a, a Facebook question about uh, what do I use? Um, one of the coolest compliments somebody can give you is when they accuse you of being on steroids. It's possibly the most flattering thing somebody can say to you. So, and the reason why is because they're obvious, you're obviously making gains and they're either uh, impressed with it or they're intimidated by it. But I'm not using anything, I'm not using any anything. And uh, so the good thing about it is that what I do use is the pre-workout, my post-workout, and protein. Uh, I've kind of explained this in my earlier videos where I talked about doing um, gym pre uh, from bodybuilding.com and gym post from bodybuilding.com. And then my protein, I use the Pro7 uh, synthesis from NutriShop. And I personally go to NutriShop Dublin. Um, and get it from and you get 54 servings uh, each scoop has I believe 34 grams of protein um, very low so very low carbs and everything so I use two scoops of that in the morning and two scoops of that in the afternoon so just alone there it's 120 grams of protein and then I try to make sure I eat 150 grams of protein throughout my diet in the day so those are the three supplements that I use I keep it pretty simple um, I don't believe in taking uh, creatine anymore I just get it in my pre and my post. I don't believe on um, getting glutamine. I found that you can replenish your glycogen levels a lot faster just by using the dextrose packet that they give you in the gym post workout. And I don't believe uh, really you need any kind of uh, amino acids. I think you get plenty of it in your uh, shakes, your protein shakes, and you get plenty of it in your pre and your post. So I think if you can narrow it down to those three, you're gonna do yourself a whole lot of favor. And I'm one that when I started, when I was pretty heavy, I bought hundreds and hundreds of dollars worth of supplements. And it took me a while to learn the hard way that the only three, the only two things I really need is pre and post. The protein you're gonna get from real food is way better quality than the protein you're gonna get within a protein shake. It's just the fact. There isn't anybody in the fitness world that's gonna argue that with you. So. It, that's just it. If you want to get good casing protein, get some yogurt, get some cottage cheese at night, throw that in. It's going to do a lot better than a protein shake. When you wake up in your morning, if you have any chicken rotisserie or if you have any white eggs or eggs, plain eggs, it's going to be a whole lot, pro whole lot more protein in that concentrated with digestive enzymes and everything in the raw matter than you are going to get in a shake. But again, I still use shakes. Uh, I use shakes in the morning and shakes at night. I do like the concept of uh, feeding my muscles protein for eight hours, something that I'm into. As as you can watch from these videos, I'm burning fat and I'm putting on muscle. So Thursday will be my body fat test. We'll really get to see if I uh, put my money where my mouth is. All right, so I'm gonna go ahead and get going with my day. This is Joey and I'm out.